I walk in and he's not on the bed because it's not their bed. We're at somebody else's house. Ronnie, we're at my partner Jack girl house. We at her house. So they're on the floor, and all I see is his legs like levitated. Say I see my feet. I see his legs like levitated in the air, bro, like floating off the ground. Uh, I was gonna blab my twin oh. Yeah, the sky go hard oh, oh, oh. Bow around like J-Bow oh. Bow around like J-Bow oh. Bow around like J-Bow oh. Key oh. YouTube! What's going on, man? It's your boy J-5 Back with another video, man And as y'all see from today's title, bro I'm doing a story time, bro I can't remember the last time I did a story time It's been a minute, so you know I had to when this happened to me, bro, y'all know I had to jump on here and tell y'all how it went, bro. So, boom. I'm finna get straight into this story, bro. Y'all see from today's title, I'm doing a story time. And y'all also see, I walked in on somebody giving somebody head, bro. I ain't gonna tell y'all who to the end of the story, well, between the story, but y'all see from today's title. It's gonna be a juicy little story time banger, bro. So, first we're gonna start off by naming these people, bro. So, the dude that I walked in on getting head was my partner. We're gonna call him, uh, we're gonna call him Cody, right? Cody, boom. So the female I walked in on him that was giving him head, we're gonna call her Zoe. Cody and Zoe gonna be the name for them for this story, bro. So let's go ahead and get into it. So I got this partner, right? Of course, I got the partner that got head, and I got this partner that we be with all the time. His girl got her own place, right? So for a minute, we had our little group. It was me, it was a group of my friends and a group of her friends that all came together we would play like uno and how to go see her house because she had her own crib or whatever right so boom so everybody knew that cody and zoe had this little thing going on right so we go over there this the first this this the first night like the first night i ain't walking to own them until the second night but the first night played into the first the first night played into the second night so the first night we all over there we playing like uno or whatever blase 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 and the way it went down is the reason this ended up happening is because so we text, we got me and my bro and Cody, we all got this group chat, right? So me and my bro, we're gonna call him uh Jack. Me and Jack texting the group chat, texting Cody, right? And we tell him, we like, hey bro, we, we dare him like, hey, we bet you can't do this. Cause it's the girl, the girl Zoe and this other girl, he had a thing going on with like, I guess both of them or something like that. I don't really know. I just know he had the thing going on with Zoe, but Jack knew about the other girl. So I'm texting, I'm like, me being me, I'm starting, I'm like, hey, I bet you can't do this with both of them. So he was like, bet, cause he swear he this guy, like he swear he got Mac game and everything. Like he swear he that dude, he swear he can riz or sauce anybody up. So we thought, I'm saying, hey, I bet you can't get both of them in the room and do this with him. So he takes it, he accepts the challenge, right? And he, they already, the females are already in the room. Like the females in the room, they was just like chopping it up and the, the dudes were just outside like chilling, playing or whatever. So, we had the game and all shit. That's what I mean by plan. So y'all don't take that too far when I say plan. But yeah, we playing the game or whatever. And we text him. So he go in there. He closed the door with a little grin on his face. I'm like, yo, he like that. Like, he he risked up. I'm thinking he's going to do that. Like, three minutes go by. And they come out screaming at all of us. They come out screaming at me and Jack. What did hey, y'all telling him to do this for? And the blase, blase, this, blase. But we like, what the hell just happened? Like, how did they know? They was like, oh, y'all didn't think Tony was going to show us what y'all said? We like... Tony, you're a sale. You're a sellout. So he walks out the room laughing. And he was like, bro, there's no way you just did that. Like, there's no way you just sold like that. He was like, bro, I have it. We was like, bro, we thought you was gangster. We thought you was player. Like, we thought you was like that. But apparently you're not. So I guess he took offense to that, right, when we said that. So after that going, we like, everybody come back out the room. We like playing with no shit. You know, the usual. And then everybody go home. So the next night, we go over there again, right? But the other girl, not Zoe, but the other girl, she didn't come this time. It's just like. It's me, my partner Jack. <laughs> it's so funny saying Jack. Me, my partner Jack, his girl, Zoe, and Cody. We all over there, right? So, uh, once again, us being us, we playing around or whatever. And we tell Cody, hey, we bet you can't get her in there and do this. Because Cody swear he's like this. So, this is this is why we betting him to do stuff. Because he swear, like, he swear he that dude. Like, he swear he can do anything. He can pull any girl. And... In reality, he's not like that. He pulls, like, females that are in his, like, lane and, or whatever, or, like, not in his level. That's the kind of females he pulls. He don't, like, be pulling females around. He he let it go to his head, and he be, like, trying people. Like, he just that guy. Like, he 
And we've been telling him, you're not that guy. But so anyway, so it rolls over into the next night, right? So the next night, you know, we get over there. We playing Uno. We playing hide and go seek and shit like that. Listen to me, the children, whatever. So him and Cody and Zoe start, like, wrestling on the ground, right? They wrestle for about, like, a good five to ten minutes. And me and Jack, we look over at each other like, but you see this? You see what he's trying to do? He trying to, yeah, yeah. You see it? I, you see you see me see you see what he doing, right? He's like, yeah, so we take him, we take him, and we was like, hey, I bet you can't do this with her. I can't tell y'all what, what we actually said because got to keep it PG-13 for the two. But we like, I bet you can't say this. I can't, bet you can't do this with her. He was like, all right, bet. And we, but we didn't text it this time. Like, we we told it in person. Like, we told him in person. Like, I bet you can't do this with her. So he said, bet. And he like, bro, like, so she's laying on the ground. This nigga literally, like, grabs her leg and pulls her into the room. Like, slides her on the ground into the room and then closes the door. And we like, wow, that's crazy. So while that's, while, when he pulls her into the room, like, I asked my partner, Jack. I asked his girl to do my hair or whatever because they don't know how to reach his hair, so. You gotta get her on game, y'all. Y'all let her know. Go take, go DM her and be like, learn how to retwist dread so you can do JV on here. So, boom. So his girl's doing my hair, whatever. And like, ten minutes go by and we forget like they even in the room. Like we forget they even in there. And while they in there, like it gets like dead silent, like dead silent. And I look over at Jack and I'm like, hey, but you peep, they been like, they been in that room for a minute, dog. Like a good little minute they been in there. He was like. But you think he did what we told him to do? I'm like, nah, because he ain't like that. He not like that. He's like, you think so? I was like, nah, Tony not. Oops. <laughs> I messed up. Got to cut that out. I'm like, nah, Cody Cody ain't like that, bro. Cody not like that. He not built like that. And I'm like, bro, Zoe not, Zoe not even feeling him like that. She be playing with him. They be playing with each other. So another 10 minutes go by. And... I, was, I told him, I like, I told my partner, I was like, hey, Jack, turn turn the music down some. He was like, wow, I'm like, just turn it down. So he turns down the music. Once he turns down the music, they looking at me like, why we turning the music? I'm like, but y'all don't hear that? They like, hear what? I'm like, y'all don't hear how fucking quiet it is, bro? I mean, y'all don't hear how F-U-C-K quiet it is in here, bro? Like, no noise. They like, yeah, I was like, bro, no, no, no. Y'all not thinking. I said, who in that room right now? They was like, right. So I was like, you think they doing something? He was like, I don't know. Maybe they been in there for a minute. I'm like, all right, you right. I was like, should I go in there? This nigga starts crying, laughing. Like, when I say, should I go in there? He was like, hey, bro, that's on you. So, I'm like, all right, then I'm going to go in there. So, I tell him to turn out everything, and I walk over to the door, and I kind of put my ears to the door. I don't hear nothing. So, me being me, the D-U-M-B-A-S-S I am, I open the door, and I kind of, like, push it back. And as I push it back, bro, I swear to God, bro, I swear on, on my, on my something, on my everything, bro. All I see is this right here. Hold on. I gotta take my shoes off for this. All I see. Oh, I got a hole in my pants. I've been through that with, I don't even know why I'm acting like that. I've been through that with there. Y'all didn't though, so it's embarrassing. These are my work pants, but. So, I walk in and he's not on the bed because it's not their bed. We're at somebody else's house. Remind me, we're at my partner Jack girl house. We at her house. So they're on the floor. And all I see is his legs like levitated. So y'all see my feet. I see his legs like levitated in the air, bro, like floating off the ground. And I'm like, what the is going on? And then I peep her in the middle because Tony like super dark. And she had on dark clothes too. So I'm thinking he just landed on the ground. But then I see her little light skinned head pop up. And when it popped up, it made direct eye contact with me. And I'm like, And, bro, I instantly run back out the room, bro. I instantly run back out the room. And when I run out the room, I'm crying, laughing. And they like, what? I'm like, bro, I just seen Tony feet levitating off the ground. He like, what you mean? I said, bro, he's getting the best dome of his life, bro. He has to be. His legs are literally levitated off the ground, bro. Like, what could possibly be going on? His legs are levitated off the ground. They was like, you right. So then, 10 minutes later, go, go by. And they come out the room. They come out the room grinning and laughing. And when I say they come out the room grinning and laughing, they grinning and laughing hard. Now, on top of that, Zoe's hair is, like, messed up. It's like mine's, like, right now. Her hair is, like, going everywhere. Her hair is messed up, bro. So, I'm like, he in there monkey gripping her head, bro. So, I'm like, wow, that's crazy. So, then they was like, she walked out. She's like, who came in the room? Who came in the room? I'm like, 
I came in the room and seen something I didn't expect to see. I said, I thought you were a child of God. Apparently not. Because you're going crazy in there. And I'm like, bro, that's crazy. And they're like, why you come in? Why you come in? Because y'all left the door unlocked. Y'all left the door unlocked. That's why I came in. Was I not supposed to come in? I mean, I wasn't supposed to come in. But I wanted to come in just to see because I guess I'm horny like that then if I want to see. Dang. Now I regret telling this story because in all reality, I sound like the hornball. Because I knew they were getting on in there, but why would I go in there? That's crazy. Might not post this video. Moral of the story is, kids, if somebody getting their freak on, don't go in the room, bro. Simple as that. If you made it this far, go like, comment, and subscribe, and don't go in that room if that door is closed. I woke up this morning, money on my mind. I wanted, I get it, I don't waste no time. They call me a king, you know my jewelry shining. Don't be in my business, only I should mind it. Don't gotta hustle, better go and find it. I did the dash and started seeing sirens. I still be going blind and see these diamonds. The way that I'm taking out, they think I'm flying. The way I've been working closer to retirement. I'm about to be a product of environment. Surrounded by hustlers, wealthy, that's my timing. Chilling with shorty, constantly we vibing. I'm really low key the way I move in silence. Hopping the whip, we cruising, we just riding. Pull up and charges moving looking violent i got a hundred racks inside my locket